When discussing the count if and sum if formulas, it is good to know that there is another way to do it in Excel that is called a pivot table. Uh, I've devoted a separate course to pivot tables, so please don't hesitate to uh, take advantage of it. And uh, I would like to show you now that the pivot table offers in a more quicker and the more flexible way exactly the same things we did uh, with with uh, the category and the producers that can quickly generate a cross tab in here and then we can either sum the sales amounts inside or by using once again the sales inside we can under right click change the way we summarize the data on the conjunction of uh, the of the producers and category by changing it either to count or to average mean or max so whenever you think of uh, calculating sums and uh, counts usually the pivot table is a better choice so please make sure you check the other course